guys, welcome back to my channel. I am here with my friend Crystal. Me. Yay. <laughs> we are so excited today because we are doing a Trader Joe's taste test, but fall edition. So everything we have is, you know, pumpkin, apple, yes. cinnamon Ginger. vibes. Yeah. yeah. We're so excited. Before we get any further into it, I wanted to explain our rubric. So we're going to base everything on a five point scale. So one out of five, five being the best thing we've ever had. And kind of how folly it is. Yeah. So seasonal wise, if it's really, I don't know. How like to if you feel it. like, oh, like this is like, this oh, makes me like, feel like I'm in Yeah, like I'm in a pumpkin <laughs> patch, like I'm ready to go. Yeah. <laughs> so that's our first criteria. And then the second one is just, I don't know, if we just like it. Like if yeah. we. Like if we think that this is a good product, yeah. like you would get we it would again. You would eat it again, right. Yeah. And Not then. Just the how kind of special or exclusive it is to Trader Joe's because all these items are from Trader Joe's. Yes. So yeah, I mean, if you can get this anywhere, then it's not as special, you know? Yeah. I think we should just jump right into it. Our first item, we have the pumpkin spice tea. I think it's rooibos Roy tea? Yeah, yeah. rooibos tea. It smells so good. I don't know if we let it steep enough. It doesn't <laughs> taste like anything. It's kind of like watery. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't taste like anything. But maybe we just haven't steeped it long enough. We might need to come back to this. <laughs> yeah, we might need to come back. I'll try this because it's been out of the like oven for a couple minutes. But okay. It looks hot still. All right, so this is the butternut squash mac and cheese. It smells delicious. Yeah, it smells really good. <laughs> I don't like this. I feel like, I feel like when people think of fall nowadays, especially now, like they think of like pumpkin. Yeah. It's not like, oh, butternut it's not, squash. Yeah, it's not in your face fall. I feel like this is like a three on the fall scale. Wise, I feel like it's a five. Taste wise, it's a five. This is a good idea like to get from Trader Joe's to be like, oh, like maybe I should easy. bring this to like, Thanksgiving. Yeah, it's easy because you just have the microwave it and it's already like all the yeah. sauce is already made for you. But I feel like you can probably get this at other places. Yeah, and I will say also that I think like it could almost be almost more butternut squash flavor. Yeah. Right? It's kind of muted. It kind of, I don't even know if I taste butternut I'll squash. I say I don't love it. I but do. But <laughs> yeah, it's good. I don't really know what I'm tasting. I just think it's good. We're going to try the tea now. Yeah. And see if it's good. No, I feel like it's just not there. It tastes a little like water. It literally <laughs> doesn't taste like anything. I don't know. It, it's... It smells way better than it tastes. Like it doesn't taste like anything. It smells awesome. Yeah, I wish it tasted how it smelt. For fall, I would say it's like a four. For taste, I would yeah. say like a two. Yeah, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be harsh and I'm gonna give it a zero because I just think it tastes like water. Yeah, it, there's it's like a little bit. A little bit. Um, how special it is in terms of you can't get this anywhere else. I'd say like three. I agree. Because I haven't, yeah. I haven't personally seen pumpkin tea in that many places, but I'm sure you can find it somewhere. Yeah. Um, they have so. pumpkin K-cups too, but we didn't get that because they don't have a Keurig machine. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah. the tea's alright. Yeah, underwhelming. Yeah, I don't know if I would recommend that. Next up we have the biscotti. It's cute. I'm going to dip mine into the tea. Yes, I think that's what perfect you do. pairing. Pumpkin tea, pumpkin biscotti. My mom would like this. <laughs> it's not too sweet. No. It's like, I feel like that's a good part about biscotti though. I feel like it's never too sweet. But it's also not too hard because sometimes I get biscotti and it's literally like a rock mm -hmm. and you're like trying to bite down and it's just so hard. But this is like good. It's a little bit hard like biscotti usually is, but not too hard. Definitely, I definitely taste the pumpkin spice. I don't know if I taste pumpkin for sure. Yeah. Um, so I give it like a four in terms of fall. Yeah. Um, taste, it's like a five. It's really good. And then, do I just like it? I would give it a four because I'm not a huge biscotti person, yeah. but it is pretty good for biscotti. I would give it a four as well. I think that's that's good. I definitely love it. Mm -hmm. I would 100% get it again. Like I wouldn't just get it in fall. In terms of how special it is to Trader Joe's, what do we think? I mean, I haven't seen it anywhere else. Me neither. So I would give it a five. Yeah. I think it's good. Yeah. And we ate our good whole, all around. whole biscotti. <laughs> we did. And I'm going to have another and one. And we are also going to be trying the pumpkin butter with the waffles. Yeah. So the pumpkin butter is your sugar, honey, lemon juice, and then all the spices that you'd have in pumpkin spice. <laughs> it's like, it smells like pumpkin. You know, it smells like 
pumpkin and applesauce mixed together. God, I hope that's, that's not that's what this is. That's kind of what it looks I don't, like. Actually. I don't. Mm. <laughs> okay. Should we mix it around? Yeah. Yeah. Let's sure. do the plain one. Okay. It's good waffle. It's good waffle. I don't really taste the pumpkin. It just tastes like a waffle. It tastes like Eggos. Like, <laughs> yeah. <it does. laughs> Alright. I took another bite. <laughs> Flipping it. Hmm. <laughs> it, it tastes exactly like how what it, it looks, looks like. <laughs> It's exactly the same. Like it's, it's like applesauce that you had as a kid, like Mott's applesauce mixed with like they pumpkin just put puree. some spices in it. It's remember the last one we were saying pumpkin spice? Yeah. Like this one is pumpkin puree. Okay, applesauce. but like for fall, very fall. Mm -hmm. Like it's straight just pumpkin and spices. <laughs> What's there? In terms of how much we like it, like a one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not even it the could one. be a lot better. <laughs> what, what do you think? I would say one. The one. Like okay. it's the not one. like it's, it's not, not like the it's, worst it's thing it's ever. It's not bad. Yeah, because it's still like sweet yeah. and you know it's, it's not, not the like worst. I'm like oh I can't finish my waffle like I'll yeah. finish it. But I'd rather have it without it. Yeah. <laughs> and even the waffle like I mean the waffle's good like it's not bad it's just not. Yeah. I mean does yours taste pumpkin? -y? No. I've never seen pumpkin butter before so this is mm -hmm. a very Trader Josie five. Um five. I'm sorry, <laughs> Trader Josie. This is the waffle. How fall it is zero because it doesn't taste like anything. It literally tastes like an Eggo waffle. Mm -hmm. Um, Eggo's rebranded. Yeah, <laughs> Eggo's probably made this and just sold its trages. Sponsored by Stranger Things. <laughs> in terms of a waffle, it's a four. In terms of a pumpkin waffle, it's like a zero. Yeah, and then Five. have you ever this. seen? Have you ever seen a pumpkin waffle before? No. No. Okay, no, so this. it's a five on Trader Joe's level. Mm -hmm. Okay. So both were fives in Trader Joe's like exclusivity. Mm-hmm. Like we've never seen this product before. Yeah. But, but they aren't great. I products. mean it could be better. <laughs> like it's like you don't need that product. <laughs> yeah. I think we need to toast up our bagels. I agree. Let's make that happen. We have toasted our pumpkin bagels. They don't smell beautiful. I smell oh, a little actually. pumpkin actually. <laughs> I think before I was smelling the plate. <laughs> Okay, and then we're gonna pair it with our pumpkin cream cheese, which I've heard a lot about this pumpkin cream cheese. And they recommend it on the bagel packaging. Yes, yeah, so we gotta try it obviously together. And I love this packaging. It has literally a bagel with cream cheese on it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's pretty. Like Yeah, I like the fall leaves. Packaging A1. Love it. Yeah. Whoever does Trader Joe's packaging. I don't know, they're good. Um, I wanna hire them. This looks yum. It's like so orange. It kinda looks like hummus. Kind of. <laughs> I don't know if that focused, but I like the color. It looks like pumpkin. How's it smell? Ooh, it smells so good. It smells like cinnamon. <laughs> That's gonna be good. Yeah. Absolutely. Ooh, it's soft. The cream cheese is so good. It's amazing. I don't know about the bagel. This cream cheese is awesome though. <laughs> So. Interlude, my mommy is here. All right, our next item is our spice cider, which th this thing is like so large. It's really big. Um, so is this the first non-pumpkin thing we've had? Yeah, it is. Oh no, we or had the butternut, butternut squash. squash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is our first apple thing. Um, so it's basically just apple cider with a bunch of fall spices. Oh. Oh, I think it would be better hot. I do. All right, we're back. <laughs> we already tried it. We're back. We already tried it. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna fake it for you. <laughs> it's good though. I think it's. I think it's better warm. It's better warm. Yeah. yeah. It tastes like mold cider. <laughs> you know, like mold yeah. wine. <laughs> so how good? I would say a four. I love it. It's a five. It's good. Um, packaging. No, 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 no. It's oh, no. fall. Oh, fall. <laughs> how fall? It's very fall. Very fall. Five. I would say it's a five. And then I assume this like this is like not special. Exclusivity, yeah, no, it's not special. No. It's like a zero. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like a zero basically. And it's like since the beginning of time. Yeah, like everyone's had a yeah. spice cider before. But it's good. Chocolate mousse pumpkins. So they're like a cake 
but they're moose and they're shaped like a pumpkin. I don't really know what they are, but they're really cute, so we got them. They are really cute, and we're also <laughs> realizing now they might not be pumpkin flavored at all. No, I think they're literally just chocolate. I think they're just shaped that way. <laughs> a chocolate cake, and then there's chocolate mousse, and then I think it's covered. Ooh, it's slipping out of my hands. What? It's covered what in, I think, some white chocolate or something that looks like pumpkin. Cheers. Cheers. Whoa. All right, that was a lot. I wish I had the whole thing. It's so red. Oh my god. It's so chocolatey. Like, if you oh. love chocolate, this is the perfect dessert for you. But and I don't. <laughs> you know, like, it's so chocolatey. Oh, thank God for the cider. All vibes, I would say it's a two. It's because a two. Like, it doesn't taste it's like chocolate, chocolate. It's chocolate. But it's it's all about the aesthetic. I feel like taste, I don't know. I, I would give it like a four because it tastes good. It's a zero. <laughs> <laughs> this is zero to me. But I, I, I'm not big on chocolate. <laughs> I think it'd be like, maybe, maybe it'd be good, I don't know. I think it's good if you like chocolate. Um, just want some more cream Have cheese. you ever seen anything like this? I feel like, no, I've never seen anything like this. Me either, because if I had, I wouldn't get it. I would know not to get this. <laughs> I feel like it's like a four for like exclusive Trader Joe's. I think it's cute. Yeah, it's That's definitely my positive. really cute. But you're gonna need to love chocolate to love this. Do you wanna try those? I've next? been waiting for okay. these. I'm gonna all right, so we have the ghosts and bats crispy potato snacks. Oh wait, that's so cute. This is the cutest <laughs> packaging. I that think. rhymes. I love this. Um, okay, so they're basically just little potato chips, but yeah. they're shaped fun Halloween shapes, and they're not gonna so. taste like pumpkins. So <laughs> we already know that. We already know that. I'm not gonna be disappointed. Yeah, but it's so cute. Yeah, I love the packaging. The packaging is good. Like if I was a kid in Trader Joe's, I would snag those up. I'd be like, Mom, these are fun. I have the ghost. I mean, I have the bat. Do you have the ghost? I have a bat too. I want a ghost. Oh, yeah, I get the ghost. Can you see them? <laughs> <laughs> they look kind of the same. They're so cute. <laughs> they do look kind of similar. Yeah, they're. But really their cute. mouths are open like that. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. What Nothing bad to say. Mm -hmm. Potato, salt. What are those taste like though? They're um. There's a mm. snack that's already like that. Yeah, it's not yeah. shaped like that. Um, you know what that kind of tastes like? Those, uh, you know the Asian chips? Like the shrimp chips? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm like getting. the shrimp chips. Yeah. Really just all about the packaging. Um. They had a home run. Yeah. But I would say it's like a three. It's not that crazy, you know? Yeah. We knew what we were getting. Yeah. I, I say, say it's three for fall vibes. Great. Um, five for taste. Or five no, taste. four. I would give it a four because it's a little bit cardboardy, but that's yeah. kind of what you expect from a snack like that. Yeah. Um, and then, have I ever seen this before? No, this is very unique, I feel like. Yes, I definitely agree. I think it's like exclusive to Trader Joe's. Yeah, I've never seen something Extremely like cute. This. Yeah, I like it. Good all around. <laughs> this is a solid choice. We haven't we had like one it. of those in a while. It's candy corn popcorn. So yeah, so it's crunchy kernels of popcorn covered in sweet coating that tastes just like candy corn. All right, I'm gonna try the yellow one because I'm gonna I think try. That's weird. Okay, I'll try the yellow one too. And then we can both try it on orange one. Yeah. It's okay. It tastes like cracker jacks. It tastes like California. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not that bad. The yellow wasn't bad. No, let's try an orange to see yeah. if it's different. It's less sweet. The orange is different, man. Yeah. Hmm. I feel like it's the same flavor. It just there was less coating on it. Yeah. <laughs> no, that wasn't horrible. That no. I would not personally get it again, but I wouldn't if you mind like, eating it. If you like kettle corn, it's good. Yeah. Like, it tastes like kettle corn. It tastes um, like ball. Although, it's very, there's like a very hard shell, I feel like. Like, there's a lot of candy coating on it. Mm -hmm. Whereas some kettle corn, I feel like it's just like a little, a little drizzle of candy corn. Yeah. Or not candy corn, but sugar. That's not bad. Yeah. Okay. I think in terms of how fall it is, mmm. I mean, I guess because it's candy corn, but the it doesn't color. really taste like candy corn. You it's know? it's Cracker Jacks to me. Um, it's not I bad. give it I give it a three for fall. Three. Um, Exclusivity, unique. I've never seen it. Yeah, I've never seen a candy corn. But it corn. also is just branded that way. Like I think it tastes like, like yeah. I said, like Cracker Jacks or kettle corn. So like, ah, uh, it's like a three. Yeah, okay. yeah, it's a three for us. Um, and then do we like it? 
Three. Not really. <laughs> it's like I don't really. Like I wouldn't it. get it again. I give it a one because I don't like kettle corn. <laughs> I like popcorn the way it tastes. Yeah, let's put, like it, like that's, let's put it that way. I like I like it as it is. We have the cutest packaging. The Gourd Tree Pumpkin Cider, and it is so adorable. I love it. And it's literally just apple cider and pumpkin puree and spices. So very wholesome, healthy. <laughs> <laughs> it smells kind of like pumpkin. It tastes like a tree. What? <laughs> it tastes like really earthy. I'm very confused right now. I don't know what I was expecting. Not this. Not this. It doesn't taste like pumpkin. Mm. I don't know what it tastes like. Ginger. That's what it tastes like. It tastes like ginger. I would give it a four for how fall it is. Exclusive to Trader Joe's. I feel like it's pretty unique. Yeah, I think so too. Five. Yeah, five. And taste flavor how good taste i give it like a two i don't like it mm -mm. it tastes it very earthy to me i don't know like if i was gonna actively like drink something i don't think it would be this all right next up we have our jojo's which i've never actually had a jojo's before but they're yeah. supposed to be like the trader joe's oreo yeah um but this is a pumpkin cookie with pumpkin filling so I'm expecting a lot of pumpkin flavor here. Wow. Nice pumpkin-y. Mm-hmm. It tastes straight like a pumpkin. Yeah, it does. Fall vibes? Five. Five out of five. Um, it literally tastes like pumpkin spice. It tastes like pumpkins. It looks like a pumpkin. Mm -hmm. All around pumpkin vibes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is fall. Cream? Like a five out of five. I like the cream. Cookie is a little too gingery for me, I think. Like, they put too much pumpkin spice in there. Yeah. What do you think? I'm not a big fan. I don't know. It's like, I don't know what it is. I think it's just, I don't like things with a lot of icing. But I give it like a two. It's not that unique though, because it's kind of based off of Oreo. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's like a cookie with cream on it. So Yeah. So, I would say, mm, I'll give it a three. You give it a two? Mm -hmm. Anyway, we're, we're so close to the end. I know, we have... One, two, three products. Three. Oh, four. Wait, four? Ice four cream. Three. That'll be the last. The ice cream, yeah. The ice cream will be the cherry on top. Pumpkinos. Which I've seen these before, for sure. But they're basically just like Cheerios, but pumpkin flavored. Alright, we're gonna eat Those them dry with no milk because we don't like milk, so I know. This is, I feel like, very taboo to have cereal with that. Yeah, I know. Milk. I mean, don't come for us. Yeah, but I mean, mm. I like eating cereal as a little snack, so I always eat it dry. Mmm. Mmm. They're good. Okay, I mm. like those. That's not bad. They're very crunchy, very airy. You get that pumpkin. You do. Mm -hmm. It's like first mm. like pumpkin spice, like sugary, and then it's like whole grain flavor. Mm -hmm. So fall, I feel like it's like a three because yeah, yeah, they're kind of folly, but I mean, I feel like you can see these all year round, you know? Like they don't make me feel like I'm in the fall spirit necessarily. How much do we like it? I really like them. I give them like a four. I'm into them. Three, but I, I'm not a cereal person, so. Yeah, and then how exclusive these are. Have you ever seen pumpkin O's before? I've seen pumpkin cereal. I feel like pumpkin O's, maybe. I don't yeah. know. I don't feel like they're super unique. Two. Yeah, I give it like a three. Yeah. Yeah, but I would recommend them. I like them if you like cereal. Yeah, pumpkin tortilla chips. Yeah, and whole chips, which we love that. We do. We love when they're not broken. None of that crunchy kind of stuff. All right, I have two chips. They're nice and like dark. Ooh, they smell tortilla-y and I'm excited because mm. I love tortillas. Yum. Okay, I kind of, I think I see a pumpkin seed right there. Really good tortilla chip and then it's like a subtle like yeah. breath of like spices. Yeah. I yeah. like it. Yeah. I like it. No, I, would, not I mean, bad. I would eat it again. Like I wouldn't get it again, but I would. Yeah. I'll finish the bag. <laughs> I think fall wise, it's like eh, not really there. Like, no. Not like in your face. Like Not in your punch. face fall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'd say maybe like a two. Yeah. Yeah. And then 
in terms of how much I like it. I think it's a really good tortilla chip, actually. It is a good tortilla chip. I would give it like a four. Yeah. Um, and then... I like that it was whole. Do you Have you ever seen pumpkin tortilla chips? I feel like I've seen pumpkin seed tortilla chips. Yeah, pumpkin seed. Yeah, I don't know about pumpkin flavored. I think seed in general is very popular. common. Yeah. And is always good. Yeah. So. Mm, so like a three-ish. Yeah. For originality. That's a good word. That's how to put it. Originality. That's the word we were looking yes. for. Yes. This is the most fall I think you can ever get. Yeah. Cheers. <laughs> hmm. Very sweet. <laughs> like it's like straight sweet chocolate that's sugar i just drank i just ate sugar yeah <laughs> that's like the sweetest milk chocolate thing i've ever had <laughs> like i feel like they put, what is in there <laughs> i feel like they put milk sugar mm -hmm. i mean milk chocolate <laughs> and then they just threw sugar into it <laughs> covered it up <laughs> yeah and then I didn't even get a piece with like candy on it, but I think that would be even crazier. I don't think I want to. I don't think that would be a good idea. Okay, fall five. I five? Think, yeah. I don't know if anything else is going to give it a five though. I think originality, five, because I've never seen anything like this I think before. I can make this. Yeah, but this is cool. I like it. I feel like it's a five for originality. Um, taste? It's like, like a one. <laughs> I don't like a one. Yeah. Uh, what, what do you think? I like milk chocolate and I don't like that. Yeah, it's a lot. Like, I feel like, I don't know, if you're really, really into sweets, you'd be into it. Yeah. But if you're kind of more into like the dark chocolate, you would hate this. <laughs> I think Trader Joe's is really good packaging, is what I'm learning from this. Like, yeah. Every, everything is like, it's fine. Yeah. But their packaging is like, oh, it's gonna be so good. It looks amazing. Yeah. I mean, their packaging sells you. Like, this is Come all on. about the part, packaging. All about the branding. Yeah. Whoever is on their marketing branding team, they're doing they're doing the most. The final item are maple, maple ginger, ginger cookie swirl ice, ice cream. cream. Ooh. This is for me. I love this. This is a very gingery. This is good. The ginger kind of hit me. I love this. Mom, do you want to try? You said awful. Okay, it's not awful. The ice cream is too sweet. I like the ginger cookie. Five for fall. Miss. Five for fall. Originality? Originality. I feel like pretty original. Yeah, I've never seen like ginger cookie swirl. Yeah, I feel like a five. Yeah, five. Five, five, five. And then do we like it? I say it's a three for me because I'm not into the ginger that much. I give it a four because I think all these flavors like maple and ginger cookie are a lot to have like a lot of. Yeah. Like I just had a bite like and it was good. It was good. You like but it. But I don't think I could eat like, like the whole, whole thing. Bit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like, but I, I, I wouldn't think... sit here like. Yeah. It does complement each other because the ginger is like yeah. spicy and the maple is sweet. Yeah. So I mean. Good overall. All right, so I think that was everything that we got at Trader Joe's today. And I don't know, what was your favorite thing? <laughs> squash. <laughs> oh yeah, the butternut squash pasta. I think pasta. the pasta was like excellent. Yes, I, I agree. I love the biscotti. Yeah. And I mean, I think that the like ghost and bat chips are cute. Like they're not yeah. like my favorite item, but I think they're cute. Yeah, for and what I they are. Right. Okay. Yeah. I agree. The butternut yeah. squash pasta is the best thing ever and you need to get it. You need to get it. Yeah. It's yeah. awesome. It's so good. Um, it's just, I don't know, such a good pasta dish. Yes. I feel like I would want it at Thanksgiving, yeah. at Christmas, everything. <laughs> yeah. It's so um, good. And then my next favorite would probably be the cream cheese. I was going to say she liked that a lot. Yeah. The cream cheese was so good. I feel like it was life changing. If you like, like apple spice, um, pumpkin spice, like that kind of vibe. Yeah. You would love it. Um, I think those were my two favorites. Okay, what would you absolutely never get again? Um, I know what I would never get again. <laughs> yeah. These. Um, I just think they're... They're a lot. They're very rich. Like, they're really in your Too face. much. Yeah. And it's not... It's not special. Yeah, I think it, it needs to be a little bit more balanced. Yeah. You know, like I think the mousse has to be a little bit lighter and less chocolatey, and then the cake could be like at that rich, but yeah. they're both so rich that it's a lot. Which item is the 
most surprising like most which surprising, one you yeah. didn't think you'd like but you really did hmm i feel like the most surprising was the pumpkin nose mm. i didn't have very high expectations for them yeah but they they surprised me i like them i think this the i think these biscotti were just because they weren't that sweet you know yeah like they're a good, good. They're a good staple. Yeah, those were our picks from Trader Joe's. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any more video suggestions you'd like us to do, let um, yeah, let us know. Leave let it in the comments. Comment. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks Bye. For watching. Bye. <laughs>